You want to just uh, tell me a little bit about your time at Kennesaw State and uh, the relationship with uh, was it Travis Bergen you played yeah. with there? Yeah. Uh, let's see, freshman year, uh, I was backup catcher. You know, enjoyed the role. Got to learn from an older guy that he's with the Diamondbacks organization right now. Who's that? Uh, Ronnie Freeman. Okay. Great guy. And then sophomore year, it was it was an okay year. You know, could probably could have done better, but once I the first summer ball I played after my freshman year, mm -hmm. I got to I was primary catcher there. Got to learn a lot. You know, get back and get comfortable with the the new speed of the game in college. Um, is that the Cape or is that in the league? I was in the NECBL, okay. which is, it was, I was still in Massachusetts, but it was over on the west, west part. But, and then sophomore year, like I said, it was okay. You know, we, we made it to the championship game of our conference tournament and ended up losing. And then that's when I went to the Cape, you know, and I feel like by that time I'd really matured. Um, just had a huge passion to go up there and prove myself and yeah. then just enjoy it. The opportunity I had in front of me, and I, you know, I took full advantage of it. So you won the Cape Cod League MVP, yeah. right? But a lot of the players, for instance, like Bergen, uh, Chad Jenkins, yeah. you know, early in their career, a lot of us didn't have many college scholarships, which I committed really early, so I didn't talk to a whole bunch of colleges. But um, once we got there, we really put our time and effort in, you know, to the weight room, yeah. practice. Went out there and played and gave it our all, and it, I mean, showed in the end. Have you had a chance to kind of rib Chad in the fact that you've passed him as the highest drafted player? No, I'm not that kind of person. <laughs> I can't say that, but because right now he's he's a little yeah. further than I am, but <laughs> we'll probably get there. Yeah, hopefully. Have you